congratulations. The October Labor Lottery is complete. Your name was pulled. For immediate placement, report to the Ministry of Admission at Greston Border Checkpoint. An apartment will be provided for you and your family in East Greston. Expect a Class 8 dwelling. Glory to our Stotska. Hello guys and welcome to TGN the Game Nerd, the show where I talk about our play games and today we're going to be playing Papers, Please. This is actually a quite a good game. It's about like being a security checkpoint guard, I guess is the best way to describe it. And a lot of stuff happens and I don't want to spoil too much so I'll try not to say anything. I'll just go ahead and show you what the game is like and then you guys will get it as we go along. November 23rd, 1982. So if everything goes according to plan, this should be uploaded on November 23rd, 2022, which is exactly 40 years after this game takes place. Greston Border Checkpoint opens at last. After six long years, can the Ministry of Admission keep us safe? Families to reunite. So every day starts with a newspaper and then we walk to work. So first of all, to start off the day, you want to click on this little... I forget exactly what it's called. This thing that you use to make sure that a large crowd of people hear you. Our character says next. We can go ahead and open up this. I forget what that's called. Finally, I can return home. Now, an interesting thing about Papers, Please is that some of the characters are predetermined. Like this next person will always be a foreigner. This checkpoint is smaller than I expected. Thanks. And this next guy will also be a foreigner. Waiting in this dang line for eight hours. I hope it was worth it. I'm sorry. Unbelievable. Go to hell. And of course, as things go along, the rules will change and you have to pay attention to certain different things. But for now, it's pretty simple. Just if their passport... Oh, it was a mistake to open this checkpoint. And then he just leaves. Pretty ominous. And we'll be seeing a bit more of that as we go along later. Let's see if I could get... No, I can't get one last person in. Our workday is from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. And once I hit 6 p.m., we go to this screen. End of day one. Manage your expenses using the checkboxes below. So, right here, I'm going to go ahead and uncheck food because that's the most expensive one. And the best way to do it, or at least the way that I do it, is that you uncheck one and keep one checked, and then the next day you have the one that you checked last time unchecked and check the one that you need that you unchecked last time. Basically just start off with food unchecked and then if your family needs heat or if they're hungry, then have that thing checked but have the other thing unchecked. I'm sorry if I'm not very good at explaining stuff. There's a lot of things that I need to explain in a very short amount of time. November 24th, 1982. Greston Checkpoint a success. Entry restriction to relax. Admit foreigners. So now this is where the game actually starts to get interesting, where we actually have to look at people's documents and see if they're, you know, allowed to get in or not. Analysis upbeat. upbeat. Increased trade and co cooperation predicted. Walk to work. Let's go ahead and open this up. This first person, I believe, is always able to be approved. Cause no trouble. There is always a bit of stress whenever it's in between people. Oh, this person has an invalid expiration date. This document is expired. What? That is a mistake. I just renewed it. Even though they say they just renewed it, just go ahead and deny them. Because, you know, you need proper papers to actually get through here. This fourth person. Hurry up. I'm meeting bus soon. This person is always approvable, so just go ahead and give it to them. They're really impatient, but unfortunately we can't deny them from anything. Alright. So these people are always approvable when they give you this card for a certain place. They are always approvable. There's one exception to this, though, but we'll get to that a little bit later. Papers, please. So this person, I'm not sure if that 
is a place in Oberstan. The day was cut short by a terrorist attack. Your son is sick and needs medicine. Progress is saved at the start of each day. Terrorists strike at Greston. Collection agitators, agitators are suspected. Checkpoint lockdown. More guards, more scrutiny. November 25th, 1982. So this person is always approvable. This next person, this is something that might trip you up. Sometimes they don't give all of their, they don't give everything that they need to give. So be sure to ask about something if they're missing it immediately. This person I believe is approvable though. Cause no trouble. And I believe this person is... When they give you the pink vice card, just go ahead and approve them. Heard about terrorist attack. You're lucky to have a job still. This person is always approvable. Be safe. They're really nice. Kind of rare in this line of work. Papers, please. Okay, so this is something that can trip me up sometimes. The entry tickets. These are a valid on date, not an expiration date. Meaning that, oh, you're just, oh, wait, no, that's 1984. Meaning that, that this is only valid on that date, which sounds obvious, but sometimes my brain is just like, oh, it's an expiration date. Don't know what to say. Denied. So be careful. That might sometimes trip you up. This guy. Papers, please. Okay, here we go. Glory to our Stotska. The greatest country. And he doesn't give us anything. Basic rules. Entrant must have passport. Where's your passport? Passport. Our Stotska is so great. Passport not required. Right? Passport is required. Okay, okay, I hear you. I come back again. And he just leaves. You guys can go without food for another day. November 26th, 1982. Black market activity explodes. Government blames lax immigration controls. November 26th, 1982. This first person can always be approved, though. But yeah, entry permits look like this. So this next person, they'll give their papers... Papers, please. Purpose of your trip. What? I do not know. To visit? Duration of stay? A few days, maybe. They have an old entry ticket. However, as said before, foreigners require an entry permit. You have no entry permit. Entry permit? I have a ticket here. Let me through. We have to deny him, though, and he'll get quite angry about it. Ticket is not enough anymore. Get a permit. Yeah, that, I paid good money for ticket. What is the purpose of your trip? So happy that the border is open. I will visit my son. I have not seen him in six years. Duration of stay, six months. This leads to something unfortunate, though. You cannot enter using expired document. Please let me pass. My son is waiting. So now, you have a moral, like, choice. Do you let her in, but get a citation... Or do you deny her and not get a citation and properly do your job? So this is completely up to you. I'm a super sappy kind of guy, so I feel bad for these kind of people, so I'm going to let them through. Thank you. And she gives us a token. Hey, it's you again. Okay, hello again. Now I have a passport. Our Stotska best country for sure. 
and it's clearly Georgi Kostava, 1923, Men, Bestberg, 2013, Cobra Stan, 1234, OK, OK. Cobra Stan is not a real country. OK, OK. You have, you know, like passport. I understand. I come back with, again, with Petro. So, right now, our family is sick and hungry. Or at least our son is sick and everyone else is hungry, so I'll keep food, get rid of heat. And this is kind of just what we're going to be doing, is that when they're hungry, we give them food. When they're, when they're cold, we give them heat. We're going to sleep and move on to day five. Republian tracks Dar wanted for murder, so we're going to get to do something fun in this episode. Vince Lestrade's whereabouts unknown has likely fled Republia. Vince Lestrade profile. Girlfriend killed in jealous rage. So this guy is a wanted criminal. And here on November 27th, 1982. We have to stop this guy, basically. I'll, I'll, I'll get to it in a little bit. This person, he has two documents with two completely different numbers, which means that one of them is forged. There's a discrepancy here. What are you talking about? Hey, wait. Do not arrest me, please. Just deny my passport and I will go away. One moment, please. What are you doing? They say out and they take him away. This guy. This is Vince Lestrade. You're a Vince Lestrade? Damn. Look, I did not kill her. I was set up. Do not believe the Republican lies. Let me through. One moment, please. And he gets taken away. Whether he was innocent or guilty, I'll leave that up to you viewers at home. Okay, this person... Not my choice, I hate this dang country. I am passing through. Duration of stay, little as possible, two days. Ugh. So that's a bit of irony where the ones that want to be let in the most, we usually can't let through, and then the one that doesn't want to be in this country, we let in. During these early parts of the game, whenever I'm play replaying through this, I always feel like I'm missing something but because it feels like Things are going too quickly. First of truth, today is beautiful day, my friend. We finally become free from Integrian tyranny. So this guy, he is always able to be let in. His papers are always correct. However, thank you so much. Please be kind to my wife. She's just after me. Did you see my husband? He made it through, yes? And if we go to basic rules, where's your entry permit? Please, I beg you. They would not give it, give me permit. I have no choice. I would be killed if I returned to Integria. So now, you have an another moral dilemma. Do you approve and let her live? Or do you deny and, you know, properly do your job and do what you're supposed to do? I'm always really sappy, so I'll let you through. Thank you. We will not forget. So we get another citation, but we also get another token. So that's nice. Booth upgrade available. Space key to toggle inspect mode. I'm immediately going to get this and then take away their, their food. So this, like it says, allows us to press space in order to toggle inspect mode. So now, jobs few becoming fewer. Immigrants taking jobs from locals. Vince Lestrade apprehended in Greston. That's what we did. Track champ looks quite guilty now. November 28th, 1982. This, per this first person, I believe, is always approvable. This is what a work pass looks like. By the way, if you use the little announcement thing 
he just says some lines about our Stotska welcoming you. I have a job here. I believe you're a pink vice person. Yep. So yeah, she gives us that. We approve her like always. Please help me. So now, a man named Derry Ludum promised me and my sister good work in our Stotska. I do not trust him. I am afraid he will take my passport and force me to work at brothel. He's in line today. Please do something. Oh, hey, it's you. Old friend, hello. I am back again. This time, everything is set. You need a an entry permit. Oh, man, you funny guy. An entry permit is required. Oh, you run a very strict border here. That is good. Do job right. I look for entry thing and come back. This man. Hello, friend. You come down, I give you good girl. Dairy Ludum. Maybe it'd be Dari Ludum. However you pronounce it, this guy is a criminal. You are Dairy Ludum? Of course, it says on passport. One moment. What is this? Give my papers back. We're gonna immediately get him out of there. This guy is always approvable. Come for a visit. Duration of stay? Stay two months. Visiting relatives. A few weeks. The day was cut short by a terrorist attack. Your son is sick and needs medicine. So yeah, that's gonna happen kind of a lot, unfortunately. And every time it does, security gets tighter and tighter. On a happier note, human trafficking ring shut down. Greston Checkpoint Officer Neb's mastermind. And another attack at Greston Checkpoint. That's not as happy. November 29th, 1982. Visiting friends, two weeks. So this person is from Kalechia. So we're going to go ahead and open up our basic rules. And make sure that this Kalechian is searched. I believe this person will be okay, but this is just for a tutorial. Yep. So we're just going to approve this person. Not all people who are, you know, confirmed not to be terrorists are have the proper documents, but I believe this person is okay, so I'm just going to let them in. This person, this is what I was talking about earlier when I said that scanning would allow us to see what gender they are. And so this person is a male. I'm going to go ahead and I believe they're approvable. So I'm just going to give them that stuff. This guy, Shadi Safadi. I believe this guy. Whenever you check him. Yep, he has some contraband on him, so we're going to go ahead and get him out of there. Zero tolerance for contraband. You can see that? Slow down, my friend. I have only harmless, harmless medicine. I give you ten credits to let me through. Nah, we can't be bribed. You cannot bribe an officer of our Stotska. They must pay well for such obedience, dog. Clutching leader files complaint. Claims unprovoked border searches violate rights. So this is in response to what we were doing in the last episode where we 
where we checked everyone from Kalechia and not really anyone else. This first person is diplomatic auth has diplomatic authorization and they are always approvable. Oh hey, it's you. Are you happy to see? I have everything you ask for now. So earlier he misunderstood when we said entry permit and he said and he went and got a no longer needed entry ticket. Hey no. You guys sold me tickets. Say is good. You check again, maybe. No matter how many times we check. We'll always need to deny. Do not come back again. Haha. <laughs> you nice guy, but I have business in Arstotska. I get to write papers and come see you. So yeah, if you couldn't tell already, he is going to be a sort of recurring character. This guy. Papers, please. The order awaits. Those are the Ezek members. They gave us a name. Corman Drex. Now this is where this the path sort of splits, and you have to make a decision. When going, there are three main endings in the game. There's there's one where you're a good, you know, person serving your country. There's one where at the very end of the game you escape the country, and there's one where you join the Isaac members and. You can decide, and I'll make sure to note when it happens, you can decide whether or not you want to, when you're, if you guys want to play along and, like, play this game, you can decide whether or not you want to join the Isaac members, or if you want to stop them. Okay, this is Corman Drex. Now, here's an interesting thing that I'm pretty sure no matter what, um, I'm pretty sure that no matter what route you're on, you want to accept this guy. But something that I like to do whenever I'm playing through this game is to deny this guy just to make sure that I, that I don't accidentally do anything Isaac related. We deny this guy and he just goes away. But later they'll be like, hey, you messed up the order thing. Why are you doing that? So yeah, that's the first and pretty much only time. Or there may there may be other points where I deny someone who's clear for entry just because I want to make sure that I get the best possible ending and you're a criminal. Booth upgrade available. Awesome. So this is another great upgrade. All of the upgrades are great. Uh, except for like one, which, is, which I don't really use, but they're hungry, so they need food, but they don't need heat. And I'm going to upgrade my booth. Top level collection exposed as our stoats can spy, missing from post, presumed dead. So now we're in December of 1982, and we can see this guard is right out front. Sometimes the guards want to talk to us about stuff. I'm just going to put that right there. Inspector, an undercover agent of, of the Ministry of Information has been compromised. The, the Ministry of Admission has offered its services as liaison. As liaison. Expect a possible drop later today. Glory to our Stotska. So I'm going to say next, the guard is going to walk in. Hello. Are you the spy? What? No. I am guard here. My name is Kalensk. They told me I get good, good position, then send me here. This is thanks I get. Now they pay me almost nothing. They pay us all as much. Yes, but look. I get small bonus when you detain people. More you detain, more they give me for processing. But this is not fair, right? You should get something too. So I fix this problem. I give you five credits from my bonus for every two people you detain. Sounds like good deal to me. I give money to you after I get paid. Let us make the best of this. So now we're going to get an extra bonus for detaining people. So yeah, before we were getting pretty, mu pretty much paid the exact same stuff as letting a person in, but now we have more of a reason to detain people. So if you weren't before, it's probably best to start doing that now. Papers, please. I do not have much time. You must hold on to these. Keep them safe today. I'm being followed by an imposter. 
they pretend to be from Ministry of Information, but it is a lie. If they ask for documents, give these instead. Do not mix them up. So I, I'm giving the fake, the imposter, these documents. And so I'm just going to hide the real documents just so I don't accidentally do that. Because I know I'm going to mess it up somehow if I don't do that. Papers, please. Your papers? I am from the Ministry of Information. You have something to give to us. They bribe us with $10. Give them the fake documents? Perfect. And they walk away. Corman Drex. This is your last chance if you want to let them in. I'm going to deny him again. My name is Corman Drex. You have something of mine. Here you go. Very good. Read quickly. Arstotzka's great country poisoned by corrupt leaders. War has made government greedy and paranoid. You have seen for yourself. Help us free Arstotzka from its shackles. The Order of the Isaac Star. Do not lose this. Now, no matter what you do with Corman Drax, you get given codes. Okay. Nothing big happening today. Uh, get rid of food. Kalechia cleans house, attacks its own. Round of disappearances blamed on faulty evidence. December 2nd, 1982. Okay, so now this. This is basically your boss, sort of. And so we're just gonna open this up, wait for him to get over here. So he's both good and bad because he goes ahead and gives us like a free like entrant before the day even starts but he's also gonna insult us a bunch so <clears throat> so you are inspector here what makes you my responsibility you have received seven citations perhaps it was a mistake to rely on lottery let this motivate you hang it on wall here i return in 10 days do not embarrass me glory to our Stotska. I don't know why I give them all a deep voice, but yeah, he basically insults you, gives you a plaque, and then leaves. So we're just gonna hang, hang that up on the wall. Okay, purpose of trip. Just visiting. Duration of stay, two weeks. You do not have a passport, sir. Passport is required. They took away my passport. We're just gonna deny him like usual. No, I'm not leaving. And we're going to detain him. Delaying the line. I refuse. You fools better not touch me. I'll explode like wild tiger. I have every right to enter our stoves again. You think I am joking, but the tiger does not joke. Let me through. And he gets carried off by the guards. That is not your face. I will visit friends. Two weeks. Had surgery. That Those are not even close to the same fingerprints. Sure are giving the guards a workout today. <laughs> Papers, please. Our agents are ready. Starting tomorrow. Let them pass. So now, if we take this document and line it up just right, we get Stephanie Greer, or Stephanie Greer, and Mikhail, Ser and is it Mikhail or Michael? It's probably Mikhail. Mikhail Seratov. I'll just call him Mr. Seratov. Theft at Ministry admission. Limited effects, few items stolen. Integrity of domestic spying exposed whistleblower on the run. Basically what that first article meant, I believe is that there was a break-in where now there's a lot more forged documents. Yeah. Purpose of trip, visiting friends, duration of stay, remain for eight weeks. So this guy, document must have a seal, his does not. So this means that he is one of the forgers, or at least he bought a forgery, which is illegal. 
We're going to tell him to get out. And this next person is pretty important as well because it's Georgie Costava. Hello, my guy. Okay, today is day. Look at all good papers. N was not easy. Or cheap. Ha <laughs> ha. Shockingly, we're able to approve him this time around. I believe. All right, you the best. Our Stotska the best. Here, take this. And he gives us a token. Klenz comes in to talk to us. Good morning. You detained eight people. Bonus is good, they pay okay. This is not enough. Yes, I know. My wife's sick now. Neighbor spreads the flu. This is what he's left after medicine. I give you the rest next time. Maybe you detain more people to make it easier. I detained like five people just the other day. Yep. Next person. Sixth. This person is Mikhail Saratov. If you remember, that's the person, that's one of the people that the Isaac people asked for us to let in. However, we're on the good route. I don't know why I keep calling it the good route. It's, I believe it's called the Glory to Our Stotska route. So I'm just going to be calling it that. I'll call it the, hmm. I don't know. Uh, foreigners require an entry permit. That's the rule. Entry permit is missing. I lost it. We're going to deny him. The order knows. Quite creepy. But you know what? No matter what, we're just going to keep doing our job. We're not going to get in, into any of that stuff. Music member. Papers, please. Read quickly. Return to messenger. First agent was denied. Second will come in three days. Do not make same mistake. So basically, whenever you deny an Isaac member another Isaac member comes in and says how disappointed they are in you I believe that person's just a that person number 9 is just a random person if you are going with the member of the order route I believe that's what it's called strange brand man brought money unchecked to burn it so now we have two major things here. First of all, I'm upgrading my booth. Second of all, I'm unchecking my money. Whenever, even if you're on the member of the, or, or member of the order route, I'd say burn it. Because this will, if you do leave it checked, you do get a thousand dollars. However, later on in the game, all of your money taken away can, because you know, your neighbors are suspicious, like, hey, where'd you get all of this money? And so you get your money taken away, and then you have to later do some more missions for the Isaac in order to get stuff done. So if you want to, if you want to check it and you're okay with doing that stuff later, but I just suggest not checking it. So also I'm going to take away food. History of Arstorska. In pictures and words, mostly words. <laughs> December 4th, 1982. Oh, it's you. Good morning, Inspector. You are healthy today, yes? I just have a few questions for you. We think a suspicious group attempts to stir trouble. We think some members enter this checkpoint, so we come talk to you. Have you seen anything like this? It's some kind of symbol for group. If you have any information, give you give it to us, yes? Yes? Yes. Very good. Please return my badge and paper. Now you want to go ahead and return his badge and paper. This group is very dangerous. <coughs> if you see any cur <coughs> curious thing, report immediately. Okay, interesting thing about that guy. If you, if before giving back his badge and paper, if you give him one of these documents, he immediately arrests you. You get an ending and you also get an achievement. So if you want to get that, it's pretty early in the day. So you don't really need to worry about losing a lot of progress. And plus, 
just a quick note, whenever you get an ending, you don't have to go back to day one. You just get to restart from the beginning of the day, because like I said earlier, it saves at the beginning of every day. Oh, I know this guy. You need to go ahead and let him through. No matter what route you're doing, just go ahead and run through. You see many people, Yesh. I'm looking for engineers. Do me a favor. Give my card to any engineers you meet. I'll come back in a few days. Pay five credits for each engineer that calls me. So go ahead and keep these off to the side for now. This will be important. I'll make sure to note whenever we see an engineer. But we're basically going to give these cards out to those guys. Person number eight. This guy is an engineer. So you want to give him that. Come to work. Two months. What is this? They are hiring? Yep, indeedy. So, just because they're an engineer doesn't mean that they're free, by the way, unlike the Pink Vice people. So that there's, there still could be some sort of discrepancy, so be sure to be wary of that. I think that's all the right seals, so I'm going to go ahead and just approve them. Cause no trouble. Okay, good. Please. Visiting relatives for two weeks, 14 days. Awesome. Florian Integria, I believe that's real. This should all be good, I'm pretty sure. <sighs> okay. Purpose visit for a month. Awesome. Yurko City Kletchia, that's all good. In date, female. Whoop. Day was short, cut short by a terrorist attack. Your son is sick and needs medicine. Class 7 apartment is available. A stranger brought money again. Unchecked to burn it. So many things are happening. So yeah, another terrorist attack occurred. Now security is going to be even higher. Second of all, son needs medicine. Why do you always need medicine? Why do none of my none of the other characters ever need medicine? Third of all, class 7 apartment. I'm not entirely sure what the point is of different class apartments, but mine as well because it also allows you to get an achievement. I'm going to uncheck the Ezek gift, and then I'm also going to uncheck heat. And we're left with $95. We're running on a pretty tight budget. Uh, there is an easy mode for this game where it gives you an extra like $50 or something like that each day. Uh, but I'm not playing on that because you now sometimes when I'm like playing this game casually, I like to have it on. But you know, for the sake of the let's play, I thought I'd go ahead and just play normal mode. But yeah, unchecked easy gift, unchecked heat, checked everything else. Let's go ahead and go to sleep. Another bomber slips through. Immigrant screening falls short. MOA gets new director. Stricter protocols promised at border. So yep, every time there's a terrorist attack, defense, like, this stuff gets so much more strong. I don't know, that's not a properly phrased sentence. By the way, we have Kalensk over here for our third person. <clears throat> Good morning. You detained two people. Bonus is good. They pay okay. It is not much, though. Maybe you detain more people and we do better. So yeah, detain more people is what I'm hearing. Cause no trouble. Oh, what was it? Missing work pass. Oh, I just mentioned the work pass earlier. Hey man, I lost ID card. I think someone stole it from locker room. But we won match. Can't wait to get home. I have carried this for years. Maybe you take it? Sorry, man. You need an ID card. I know, man. I told you. It was stolen. Come on. Let me through. We're just gonna deny him. Hey. I give you pendant even. I'm gonna tell the coach about this crap. And so now just to taunt him, we're gonna hang that up on our wall. We're gonna need to take that down later. Because whenever the inspector comes by, he's basically just like, Hey, the only thing you should have on your wall is my uh, plaque. Short crop tear. 182 centimeters. 
end date. Nicholas. Matching numbers. Outer Grouse. Mail. End date. Awesome. Uh, work for three months, you said? Work for a few months. Okay, that's in date. That should be good. Oh, right. You're a engineer. Let me go ahead and give, give you that stuff. They're hiring, and then we let them through. Cause no trouble. Okay. So it should be just randoms for the rest of the day. A Crunwell safe haven. Our Stotska earns dubious reputation. Antegrian whistleblower denied asylum in Republia. So today is December 6th, which I think is the day that I'll be uploading the finale to this series. I'm not entirely sure. Okay. First person. Immediately. They're a criminal. Just gotta get through all of the dialogue. Maybe you should, you should not have come. I have nothing to say. Well, then get out of here. You can open up this still. Which is weird, but I'll keep it closed just because of immersion and stuff like that. Because they could still, like, hurt us. Not, like, actually, but, like, in-universe. Hey, it's me from the future coming in just to say real quick that the fourth entrant for this day is an engineer. And you want to go ahead and give him the little card that you get the business card and i just forgot to do that because i was just real i forget if i was tired or i was just real scatterbrained during this video but yeah make sure to give the uh business card to him okay you're you're a criminal so we're gonna go ahead and arrest you right here we get rid of you. Then this next guy. <clears throat> Papers, please. Shit. I make small mistake. Please give documents back. He handed us he handed us two passports. So we don't even need to do any, you know, checking with highlighting discrepancies. We just throw them in the slammer immediately. This person. Stephanie Greer, you may have forgotten her name, but sh she was another person in the Ezek Order. So we're going to deny her because we're on the Glory to Our Stotska route, but obviously if you're in going on the Member of the Order route, you want to let her in. She's missing documents anyway, so we might as well. Breakthrough Spinal Surgery Perfected, only possible with our Stotskin expertise. I don't think there's any new rules here today, so this might be more of a relaxing one. Okay, person number two is interesting. Papers, please. Death to our Stotska. And just places a bomb on our desk. What is going on? Oh, huh. What is that amateur? Should we evacuate for that little thing? No, of course not. Just disable it. Open the cover. Just gotta take out all of the screws. Stupid terrorist. Could not even add the display. What should I do now? See, this is the poorest bomb I ever seen. A simple minded cre created this. Just cut the wires in order. So, one, two, three, and four. Okay, all done. Back to work. We should close the checkpoint. I need to earn money today. Give me a bomb to me. I, I sell materials and give you cut. What the piece of shit. I doubt it is even worth much. Call the next immigrant. And we just move on with our day. Okay. Come to work. Duration of stay, I stayed 30 days. Are you... Are you a... Yep, you're an engineer. Here you go. What is this? Huh. Okay. Now it's time to actually do your things. 90, short straight hair. Uh, you're right on the line with that date. Numbers. Work for a year, you said? That's not a year. 
Apologies, it will be one year. Okay. Is that the right... Hold on. Work passes. Yeah, that's the right thing. Okay, just wanted to make sure. Margaris Oberstan. Uh, okay, you're approved. Cause no trouble. Music member. Papers, please. Give me coded documents. Both. Probably give... I should probably give the Isaac member a distinctive voice. Both agents were denied. We cannot succeed without your help. When our Stotska was born, the order fulfilled the same role as today. When tyranny ends, we will disappear again. And he disappears. Ministers fight over staff. Qualified guards, soldiers in demand. Kalensk is about to talk to us right off the bat. You detained eight people, here, for bonus and selling bomb parts. They move on our station to prison. We still get bonus till keep detaining. I stop visiting you here. I'll drop off money at their home instead, every other night. You don't have... Come for medical reasons. Your papers are missing. Please. A surgery I need is outlawed in Kolechia. Even so, I do not trust doctors there. Only our Stotska have skilled surgeons. So this is out of the right documents. Yes, they will not, not give papers for surgery. So this is interesting because you might immediately think, oh, this is where we get the token. There is no reward for letting this person through. So you can decide do you want to let this person through because they really really need it but you have but you get no reward for it thank you i'll not forget this citations have no real impact on whether or not you get the glory to our stotska ending so don't worry about that this guy I am back. How many engineers did you meet? I got three calls. I must have missed a guy. Oh, I didn't. I forgot. What was the other guy that I missed? I'll probably have put it up on screen already, so. Yeah, but this guy, he's good as always, so go ahead and approve. Glory to Arstotska. Okay. Oh. Got him. Okay, I forgot that I was supposed to do that for a second, so I just sat by and waited. Oh. They was cut short by a terrorist attack, and we get a sharpshooter bonus, so we don't need uh, heat. Oh my god, the panic that I had because I forgot that I was supposed to do stuff because my key was buried under all of the different documents. Uh, but anyways, Greston incident highlights security risks, further breaches predicted. Integrian whistleblower turned away from United Federation. This is December 9th, 1982. Hello. I heard that you are from Nursk. I grew up there, but I have not been back in many years. It is still a shithole, as before. <laughs> of course, this is what I remember too. I am Sergio. It is nice it is good to meet you. I will do my best to keep you safe. I like him a lot. He's going to be a great character throughout this game. And I can't wait for you guys to meet him too. Papers, please. Border attacks are not Isaac operations. Unknown extremist groups responsible. The order aims to weaken corrupt power centers, not injure innocents. Isaac agent arrives today to uncover extremists. 
today. And we get this. Now, I'm not really sure how to go about unlocking this. Purpose of your trip. A right report on conditions in our stuts. Got duration of stay as long as it takes. That's very vague, and also you just gave me, like, a press pass and not any actual documents. You are missing required papers. I am journalist. You have my pass there. We're just gonna deny him. This is outrage. Why am I denied? Your press pass is worthless for entry. This is violation of rights. I will not lay down for your corrupt abuses. Expect to read about this. So yeah, a lot of those guys just come in thinking they can do whatever and they just really can't. This person. I want to see... Okay. So if you put this little box right at the start of their name... It spells out Ezek. And so we're going to go ahead and deny him. First, I'll go ahead and say, hey, where's your stuff? Oh, wait. Oh, right, you're a foreigner. You need an ID card. Or not a foreigner. You're a local. Need your ID card. I lost it. We're going to deny you because we're on the Arstotska route. Your son's birthday is in two days. Class 6 apartment is available. Ren equals 40, heat equals 5. So I'm going to go ahead and get that and get rid of food. I forgot to look up in between episodes if there's a purpose for, you know, different class apartments or if it's just like, you know, you pay a bit more, but I don't know. Import protests unbalanced trade restrictions. Claims our stoves got unfairly taxes and Porian goods. Our, our Stotska's iron border in tier... Internal media reveals entry visa bias. Okay, so remember before how we denied the person with a pass that allows them to get, that like said, hey, I've got, you know, I'm a reporter, I should be allowed in. Well, they wrote about us and now I think that we're gonna have some more stuff to deal with. First person. Papers, please. They do not have an ID card. Let me go ahead and do that. I need your ID card. I lost it. So now we have to take out all of our stamps, deny, and then add our reason for denial. So yeah, you can put both stamps wherever as long as it's on the passport fully. Denied? For what reason? It, it's clearly stamped there. Oh. Screw you anyways. <laughs> Next person. Papers, please. Purpose of your trip. Transit through the country. Duration of stay. Now, person is running to jump over the wall. You can immediately pull this out and get him. Nice. End of day 18. The day was cut short by a terrorist attack. Your son is sick and needs medicine. Your son's birthday is tomorrow. He wants an expensive crayon set. So, get rid of... I'll pay for son's gift. Gonna get rid of heat, though. We're really tight on money, but I want to make my son happy. For one specific reason. Import begins trade sanctions. Immediately restricts all imports from our Stutska. We've got Sergei right out here. Thank you for yesterday. My aim is not like before. Just a simple thank you. That's nice. Now you might start to see why he's one of my favorite characters. It's just because he's really nice. You know, going out of his way to go ahead and thank us for yesterday. Purpose of your trip. I'm coming to live with my wife. Oh, I'm so sorry. Wait. Yeah. No injury from Impor. Importance are prohibited from entering. Papers, please. Hey, I know you. You are from Nursk? I worked with your father for many years. You were such a little brat. <laughs> you want to go ahead and approve this person? 
I go back to Nursk and tell them you are doing well here. Hey, it's Georgie. Again, I am here. Everything is all set up now. I come off through often to see you. We become good friends. Yes, unfortunately, if we check his weight. Your weight is different. It's a sad story. My wife very bad cook. But if I do not eat, she get angry. Turn towards the scanner. Uh-oh, maybe you not like this. Unfortunately, Georgie is a drug dealer. What is this? He has drugs. I have little side business here. You let me through and I give you something something. Something what? Ten credits. I give you ten credits for just a little stamp. Wait here, Georgie. It's okay, I understand. Drugs are bad, not good for kids. You do great work here still. Okay, got 17 people. That's pretty nice. Was that more than I got on day one? Your son has drawn a picture for you to take to work. That's nice. I'll go ahead and get rid of food. Impor sanctions end. Over so fast? What happened? So yeah, that's an interesting thought. Is there... Has there been any point in history... Oh, our boss is here. Let me go to... We gotta head... Gotta let a... Gotta go ahead and take stuff down from the wall. Just have to keep the plaque up. I don't know why I get so anxious whenever our boss is walking over here, like, you know, like I'm getting evaluated for real, like, my skill as a player. Oh, okay. Too early to come all the way out here. The smell of this checkpoint makes me sick. At least your performance is not terrible. You've received seven citations. Do not slip further. Now, I have... I have old friend coming through. A proof for entry. She's Shea Piersovska. I did not want to hear of any trouble to her. Glory to our Stotska. And he leaves. So keep that name in mind. Shea Piersovska. Got an order member. Read quickly. Return to messenger. Assassin coming from Antegria. Will target important Isaac agent in our Stotska. Must be stopped. His name is Khaled Istom. Do not forget. And they give us a... Open it. Do not touch powder. This is actually poison. And so if you click on it, you'll die. Um, and so now, later when we run into Khaled Istom, if you want to, you know, go along with the order, then you poison him. If you want to go along with Arstotska, then do not. Oh, the purpose of your trip... I cover big story. Duration of stay? I cannot say. Maybe a few days, maybe a few weeks. You need to get out of here because you do not have an... an wait. You're missing required papers. I'm a reporter. I have a right to enter. Give me a visa stamp. Oh, I'll give you a stamp, all right. Two, even. Pass means nothing. And she calls us a fascist. Jesus. This man is Khaled Istom. I will move here. We're going to let him in because we're a member of Glory to Arstotska. If you do... You know what? I won't spoil what happens if you do uh, poison him if you're on the order route. I think on my second channel, I'll go ahead and upload like what happens if you go with the member of the order route. I think that'd be fun. But yeah, I'll go ahead and approve him. Actually... Does he have the right papers? Move here. Okay. Sorry, I just immediately got got excited because I was like, okay, I know that I don't want to poison this guy, and so I just immediately thought he was able to let in. He was able to be, be let in, but... Integrin Whistleblower accepted by our Stotska. Move risks of angering... Move risks angering neighbors. December 13th, 1982. Is that you? I am seeking asylum. So we take their fingerprints. And I'm pretty sure this person is always approvable. But we always take their fingerprints so we can check them on this. So that's nice. And yeah, we'll go ahead and 
let him in. Thank you. I hope that things are better here. I hope that things are better here for you too. Person. Red stamp. What? Give me red stamp. I am serious. I have better job offer and import. Red stamp and I can break contract in our Stotska. Ten credits for you. So now it's up to you. It's a reverse of the moral dilemma that we typically have. Do you want to deny him and allow him to live a better life or approve him because that's what you're supposed to do in your job? I'll be a nice guy. Okay, now I get free from this bad job. Thanks. And listen, I know I said that I couldn't be bribed in a previous episode, but I wasn't doing it for the money. I was just doing it to help the guy out, you know? Papers, please. I have only passport, but hear me out. This, there's little time. I must enter today. I'm, I'll come back in three days with right papers. To prove I give you something important. Is special family treasure. Fully digital. You hold this collateral. I will be back to pick it up. And take this. All for green stamp. He gave us something important to him, so I thought I'd... Might as well. Thank you. Come back in a few days to pick up watch. We'll make sure to keep it for him. Purpose of your trip. I have job here. Duration of stay. Three months. Oh. Holy crap, right? All from a tranquilizer. I think if you shoot at the motorcycle, he'll blow up. Sister has been arrested. Her young daughter needs a home. Oh, adopting our niece doesn't cost as much as I thought it would. Okay, I'll go ahead and take it, especially since we got that sharpshooter bonus. And we're all cold, but we don't need food, and we're ending the day off with $100. That's pretty nice. Daring bike attack at Greston Checkpoint. Extremist growing border. Extremist growing border. Greston like magnet. There's another bit, but I forgot to read it. We have Sergio today. So that's pretty awesome. Probably coming in to thank us again. There's more action at this checkpoint than in the war. I fought in Kolechia for five years. If you think this is bad in our Stotska, Stotska is it ten times worse in Kolechia. I do not blame them for coming here. Anyways, you are doing well. Keep it up. He's a great guy. I feel like every single time we see him, I'm going to end off the sentence with that. Hi again. Remember me? Go Arse Kickers. I give you that great banner. Listen, I tell my coach about this. He gets very upset. Say if I do not get banner back, I lose front seat on team bus. All seats good, but front seat definitely best. So I really need the banner back. What do you say? Prove. You know what, I'll give you the banner. Ah, good. It's more beaten up than I remember. Even there is big tear here. What did you do? Oh well, coach should be happy. Thanks, bud. Do not forget to root for us at regionals. Alrighty, so now that plot point is resolved. Hey, it's Georgie again. Phew. Was tough one. Guard was... What? Lucky, lucky for me, guard was easy. He asked for big money. He's a reasonable man. That sounds bad. And also, your weight is still off. I see a difference here. It's real mystery for sure. Turn towards the scanner. <laughs> and unfortunately, George has fallen back on his old weight. I say old as if he did it like decades ago, but it was like just the other day. Wait, I give you 10 credits for OK stamp. Think about family. They could buy many happy things with these credits just for harmless drugs. Oh man, again. That card have another good day. Not sure I keep up this up with no sales. That's the end of day 22. Sun is sick. Class 5 apartment is available. Rent is 50. Heat is 0. 
The class 5 is the best a worker can have. Your niece has brought her mother's savings. So we got an extra $100. We're going to spend that on moving to class 5. And then we're going to go ahead and get rid of heat. Polio resurfaces in United Fed. Isolated diagnosis or something more. December 15th, 1982. Now, immediately, your eyes might be drawn to this man over here in red. We're going to keep an eye on him for a second, because he is going to be important. This second person is an Ezek member. Papers, please. Read quickly. Return to messenger. Khaled, is Khaled killed two Ezek agents. Another assassin comes. Man in red. This guy up here. Carries info on all Isaac and Arstotska. Cannot take chances. You must kill him today. We will provide opportunity. If you succeed, you will be caught. Must sacrifice self for Arstotska. Family will be safe. Shoot to kill. And they give us the silver key. If you watched previously, you might have noted that there are two different key, uh, key slots that, or key holes, I should say. That's what they're called. Where there's the tranquilizer gu gun, and this leads to an actual gun. And so we can use that to kill people if we need to. I'm not going to personally use this because I'm going for the glory to our Stutzka route. And an interesting note is that if you're going with the member of the order route, and I'm not really, it doesn't really matter what t uh, the time is passing right now, because as they just mentioned, they're going to start a riot in a little bit. But a uh, quick note is that if you're going for... What is it called? If you're going for the member of the order route, you might think, oh, I've got to go ahead and shoot the guy in red. Not the case. If you do that, you will get, um, if you do that, then you will get um, one of the endings for shooting at a random civilian, and you will get arrested. If you're going for the member of the order route, you might just want to do what I'm doing for the Glory to Arstotska route, because... <laughs> If you do what I'm doing, don't worry, you'll still be able to do the member of the order route, if my information is correct. Purpose of your trip? Visiting. For a few weeks, one month, that watch. Man, guy behind me in line would not shut up about it. On and on he went out, important it is to his family. Look, it is, is a good watch, I can see. I give you 20 credits for it right now. He say he pay you back only 10 credits. It's a good deal here, I offer you. Uh, no. Like I said earlier, we're not doing this for the money. At least, not most of it. It's not the major reason we're doing our job. And plus, the reason we're doing it, we kept it for him, is so we can give it back. We're gonna let you in, though, because you look good. Cause no trouble. Like this guy just said, the next guy... Is him. The watch guy. As promised, I am right with back with right papers now. You have my watch. Ah, she is beautiful. Here. Now I just need battery. Hey! There's new scratch here. Give money back. Wow, you're a pretty honest person. You know I cannot take this. Scratch was there before, actually. Here. So we get ten dollars. If we go ahead and let him in and don't detain him. Thank you. I start to think maybe all our Stutzkins are not so bad. And we get a token. I believe he's always good to go. Next person to come is person number eight. So what you want to do... Is once that person starts running, you want to have your key over by here. Unlock that. And shoot him out. Can the wall hold? Border safety continually questioned. December 16th, 1982. So this person is in the Altan district. As seen on their thing right here. So we want to check everything. Height. Weight. And I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter what you give this person. I'll just go ahead and approve them. Actually, no. Confiscate the passport, then approve them. Thank you, it is good to be back home. I am leaving for a trip soon, so I need my passport back. It is being confiscated. What do you mean? Contact number on slip for recovery. You can just hand it back. It has been filed, I cannot give it back. I am not leaving without passport. 
Wait here. What is happening? You cannot do this to me. I am an Arstotskin citizen. I have a right to travel freely. Well, she wouldn't leave the line. We've got another Isaac member. Read quickly, return to messenger. We have missed our chance. Man in red survives. He now targets Isaac agents in Kolechia. Our plans must adapt. If you're going for the best possible member of the order ending, you'll still get that message even if you, you know, are still on that path and you are a criminal. You. Okay, you're from the Alton district. Same date of birth, same height, same weight. You should be good. Passport? It is being confiscated. What should I do? Contact number on slip. So yeah, that's the message that he's going to say every single time someone asks for their passport back when we confiscate it. Hey, it's Georgie. It's good to see you again. Today I come for a short visit. Everything is definitely okay with me. For sure not in criminal bulletin or anything. Your face is in the wanted bulletin. What I pay police like crazy. They promise no bulletin. All clear, they say. I think twice before trusting friendly people. Eh, sorry, Georgie. Uh, it's okay. Most police know me now. I have little talk with them again. Anyway, you have a tough job. I'd rather sell drugs. Full-blown epidemic threatens United Fed. Previously under control, polio back with vengeance. So we're seeing a lot of polio talk in the news recently. Also, we have Sergio. Friend, how are you? I have a small favor to ask. During the war, I met a beautiful girl. I think about her every moment. Yesterday, I received word that she is finally coming here. Please let her pass now, be in your debt. Her name is Elisa. To Sergio, from your Elisa, I love you always. Well, Sergio's been, ni been nice to us so far, so why don't we go ahead and do him a favor? I will leave this here. You, you are hot like fire. You, object of desire. You again, wrap my heart in wire. Approve my bees. <laughs> he, although I like the note, he does not have an entry permit. Where is entry permit? What is that? We deny it. But I give you such a lovely note. But yeah, we'll just keep this note for a little bit later. Papers, please. Purpose of your trip. Transit through the country. Duration of stay. Only be two weeks. Life sucks. Nobody loves me. Let's go ahead and give her the note. For me? Like fire? Object of desire? Wow, nobody says such nice things. Part about Visa is confusing, but rest is very powerful. Thank you. So we give her the note, and we get the token. All right, now to actually do our job. Straight hair. 16853. That's all nice. In date. And we have our numbers. Have our names. Transit for two weeks, did you say? Transit for two weeks. Okay. I'll approve you. Thank you again. So yeah, we did a nice thing there. Okay, we've got the face. Alton District, so we're going to go ahead and confiscate that real quick. 176, 57, Orbeck Venor, female. Everything looks good. Just going to confiscate it real quick. And approve you. 
What is this slip? Where is passport? It is being confiscated. How will I travel? Contact number on slip. This presence was requested. How is Dimitri? I hear he runs checkpoint now. It looks like somewhere he would fit in. I bet it is he is still terrible boss. This is Shay Persovska. You might have forgotten her, but she was a friend of our boss, Dimitri, who said that we should let her in or else he'll be very angry at us. So let's go ahead and let him in. I think. I hope Dimitri tires more easily now. I do not want to stay long in our Stotska. Ministry of Health acts to protect citizens. New policy safeguards at borders. Let's walk to work. December 18th, 1982. This person. Do you know Sergio? You said you were friend, that you would help. Please, my family is gone. I have only Sergio left. This is Elisa. Now you can decide, do you want to let her in or do you want to deny her? Because she definitely doesn't have the right documents. But Sergio is waiting for her. If we give her the pendant, he is waiting for you. My love. I miss him. Thank you so much. I will never forget your kindness. So now, I want you to go ahead and watch up here. Isn't that so sweet? I always let Elisa in whenever I'm playing through this game because it just feels bad not doing that, you know? Anyways, this next person doesn't have a vaccine certification. Where's vaccine certification? I do not believe in vaccines. Okay, immediate deny. Okay, so this person is from the Alton district. So we're gonna go ahead and confiscate your stuff in a minute, but first we wanna go ahead and check everything out just to make sure. Also in terms of editing, I think I might start editing this, these videos a bit down because I've noticed when going back through some of my videos or some of the videos in here that uh, you know, sometimes it can be a bit of a, a bit of a drag to watch, so I'm gonna make sure that I try to edit this in a way that is a lot more pleasing to watch for the viewer. Okay, so now I'm going to give you to make sure you get the best possible thread. I forgot to confiscate that. Get your key ready immediately and hold it off to the right here. Two people come in, three people even. Okay, I did it. Whew, okay, Sergio is alive. You want to make sure he's alive for this next part. It's not too important, but it's something that I always want to get whenever I'm playing through this. It's not like you gain anything except happiness. Okay. Coordinated border breach. Unknown assailant swamp security. Top level talks called. Greston territory remains dividing issue. So yeah, multiple people were trying to storm the wall at the same time. But you know what? I'm gonna put all that aside for a second because we have our last talk with Sergio. So let's talk to him. <clears throat> Thank you for everything. Elisa is so happy here. She says our first son will have your name. This was fine, but I told her I want a daughter first. It is not much, but we have a small way found a small way to say thank you. Elisa will deliver it to your home. I hope it helps. Tomorrow I am transferred to another post. Stay safe, my friend. 
during that actually hold on one second order member papers please government plans to yield to collection demands and further cede Greston. Negotiations must be impeded. Allow collection diplomat, diplomat entry first, but confiscate passport first. Isaac agent will follow to assume identity. I think this is like one of the last tasks you have to do for Isaac members. Papers, please. Okay, so this is a person from the Alton district. Same name. Okay, I need to remember to a to confiscate 70 kilograms uh, polio numbers name everything looks good I'll go ahead and confiscate that and approve all oh, right gotta give you that to Passport? It is being confiscated. Why? Contact number on slip. I forgot that the passport, the, the uh, polio thing was there, and I was like, why is she just staring at me? This person. This is the collection diplomat that the Isaac members want us to confiscate the passport of. So if you're on the member of the order route, confiscate his passport. If you're a part, confiscate his passport, then approve. Then, uh, if you're on the member uh, Glory to Our Stotska route, j just approve his passport. Okay, next person we gotta let in. This is actually, this face might look familiar, this is the Isaac member. I am sent to collect di diplomat's passport. I do not have it. And he just leaves. Day 27 come to an end. The young woman drops off something. We got Elisa's gift, a hundred extra dollars, and that certainly will help us along. So yeah, we have almost two hundred dollars going into day twenty-eight. A tentative understanding. Collection talks establish common ground. Okay, December twentieth, nineteen eighty-two. I'm totally not retrying this for the second time because I forgot how to use my eyes. Purpose of your trip: only to visit. Duration of stay. Stay a couple months. So this person has an outdated uh, entry permit and a supplement. You have no access permit. What the hell is access permit? Do you mean entry permit? I have it there. I mean access permit. Never heard of it. Sounds stupid. Entry permit and supplement are no longer accepted. Access permit replaces them. Makes my job easier. I do not care about your job. Damn it. You are skin and bones. I bet you have no real strength. Come to gym. I make you big. Underweight? Weak? Tired? Join Best Gym. Get Big Town. East Creston. So yeah, he gives us that ad. He's also someone we have to confiscate the passport of, but uh... But yeah, I think that uh... This ad is funny looking. Same date of birth, same name, Genostora, that sounds right. 182 centimeters, 99 kilograms. Approved. Guarantee you get, you get big at Get Big Town, is what we do. Person number seven. Purpose of your trip, I plan to work. Duration of stay, it will be one year. And it's a drive-by. Well, looks like one of the guards did my job for me. Alrighty then. Day was cut short by a terrorist attack. Your son is sick and needs medicine. Mystery of admission information has confiscated your family's passports. So that's an interesting point in the game. We now cannot leave the country legally. Oof. Big stuff in the uh, newspaper today. December 21st, 1982. Serial child killer escapes United Fed prison. Prison. Simon Wenz, an Arstotskin native, returning home? Perhaps. Oh, it's you. Inspector. 
It has been some time. Read your bulletin, bulletin carefully today. We will be speaking with many workers. Your audit comes soon. I will personally conduct it. There is nothing to fear. Work hard. And it's Georgie. I read newspaper. Hello, Georgie. Things getting crazy in our Storska. Maybe you think about going away for a bit. Oberstan is a good place. Right next door up north. Our passports have been confiscated. We cannot leave. Hey, that is not a good sign. Hold on. I know a guy. Need forged Oberstan docks? It looks so real. Approved for entry. Just give him real passports to worth with. He charges info to match for you. I learned that in a hard way. Conditions on the back. Passport uh, costs 20 credits. Entry ticket costs 5, so 25 per each person. Client must provide existing Oberstan passport to be modified with new info. Service at border or Stutska slash Oberstan. Ask for Timofe... Timofe Wee. Okay, so I think Georgie's stuff is all good today, unless his weight is off. Nope. I think he's good. Thanks again. Hey, you know what? Take my passport. I get another one, no problem. Now memorize flyer and give back if you fi if you finish reading. Do not want to get in any, any trouble. Oberstan really great this time of year. Lots of snow. Not sure where you get more passports for family, but you a smart guy. Probably figure it out. Good luck. Look at it. Simon Wens took her from me. I follow him for many weeks. I know he comes here soon. It is big favor, I ask, but it is important. Let him through if you see him, but take his passport first. I come back. You give me his passport and I track him down. I make him suffer like he did to Julia. End of day 29. Your wife found an old family picture. You can now escape to Oberstan with two family members. So you can actually make a decision to leave some of your family members behind. I don't think you get to choose which ones you leave behind, but if you want to get the best possible ending, you want to get five Oberstan pass uh, passports. Roadblock to collection resolution. Con contested city drives wedge. And so we see that familiar card. Dimitri is coming to pay us a visit. So immediately take the drawing off of the wall. Just have his two plaques up there. We have a lot of clutter on our desk, but we'll go ahead and sort that out in a minute. Maybe this place not so bad. With everything going on, checkpoint visit is nice break. You have received 11 citations. There are no more plaques. And he just quickly makes his leave. This is Simon Wenz. Now, you decide what you want to do. I'm going to do what the heartbroken father said. I'm going to confiscate and let Wenz through. He's just going to leave silently, and we're going to wait for the father to come back. Did you see him? Give his passport to me. Yeah, this is Simon Wenz. Hmm. I know this city. He will be easily found. Let me through. Thank you. Now please give back my daughter's photo. I want to show it to him while he suffers. My Julia. Read the news tomorrow. And he gives us a token. So yeah, we're getting a lot of penalties today. Okay, we're not having the best time. But, bloody scene in Genistora. Simon Wen's found dead in confusing mess. Greston checkpoint future uncertain. Now all we have to do is get through this. Our final day, December 23rd. Exactly one month since we first arrived here. So if you're on the member of an the order route, this will be an Isaac member talking to you about how something is going to be going down later. Basically, he says that at the end of the day, there's going to be something crazy going on and to not shoot at the people there because they're going to be members of the order just like you. 
But since we're not a member of the order, obviously they're not going to disclose that with us since we have stopped them pretty much every single step of the way. It's Georgie for the final time. Oh boy, I make big score. Huge, you have no idea. Anyway, I just want to say thank you. I wait in line just for that. Maybe I quit now. Haha. Uh -huh. He gives us a good bunch of money. And we say farewell for, to Georgie for the final time in the series. You know what? I'm pretty sure this is the final person we ever have to approve. I hope that I got that correctly. It'd be funny if I didn't. Okay, we did. Because now, you'll remember we talked about plans in, uh... Yep. Holy crap, they just come in with a truck. You immediately want to grab your key. They kill all of the guards. And once you take both out, you have completed your job here. This top one you want to get first because he'll try to blow up the wall. Day was cut short by a terrorist attack. You've rushed home and amid the panic and work to check on your family. Your information audit is scheduled for tomorrow morning. You can now escape to Oberstown with four of your family members. I will not be doing that. We couldn't even if we wanted to because even if you get rid of food, you can only escape with three. So you know what? We'll just keep that checked for now. And now that we've completed day 31, it is the end of Papers, Please. So let's head to bed. Hello, Inspector. We have audited your activities for the past 20 years. There are some anomalies, but you have served our Stotska well. We will overlook these small transgressions. You have been cleared of any suspicion. Glory to our Stotska. A new agreement has been reached with Kolechia. Creston Border Checkpoint will reopen soon. Return to your post on January 1st. Endless Unlock Code 62131. So if you want to play Endless Mode, then go ahead and do that with whatever code you get at the end of the game. And with that, we get our stats. We played for 4 hours, 44 minutes, and 56 seconds. We have 332 travelers processed, 173 approved, 85 denied, 59 detained, 31 citations. Dang, that's more than I thought I would get. 269 stamps applied, and we have ending 20 of 20. And we get the credits. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been such a fun game to play. It's, it's very stressful. I won't deny that. It is a very stressful game to play, but in a good type of way, which is something that I didn't think I'd ever say about any game, that it's stressful in a good way. But this honestly is. It is so fun to play. And just see, getting to see the lives of these different people while you're working as a security guard checkpoint and getting to see your favorite characters. Like, my personal favorite characters are Georgie, of course, Sergio, of course, and Elisa, of course, because they're just so nice. I also love the uh, heartbroken father, the guy who uh, went after Simon Wins. That was super awesome how he went after him. But this is just so good. I can't put into words how much I love this game. Now it's time to put into words how much I want to thank you guys so much for watching. It is just... I'm just so glad every time you guys watch some of my videos. It's just so cool to see that other people are interested in stuff that I'm also in interested. And it's fun to have people experience stuff for the first time through my videos. Uh, so if you are one of those people who have experienced a, a video game for the first time through one of my videos... Uh, let me know in the comments below, and yeah, I don't have anything else to say other than just thank you guys so much for watching. I hope I can be entertaining for you guys in the future. I am super duper excited for the next game coming up. I'll have a lot more to say about that game, just because there's a lot more to say about that game in general, just because there's so much inside of that game, but also just because, like, 
you know, with Papers, Please, I love this game, but there's not much to say about it once you've gotten through, like, 20 or 30-something days of just doing a lot of the same stuff over and over. Still love this game, though. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.